All right, and my last stop for the day is Old Time Treasures in uh, half, halfway, Mar where am I? Somewhere in Maryland. Let's go in and see what they got. It's been a while. This booth always has such great stuff. They have really fun clothing. Look at this. Oh my gosh, how cute. Reminds me of Paddington Bear. Ooh, look at this necklace. Beaded necklace, $14.50. That's pretty fantastic. Is there a discount in this booth? Damn, so cheap. Oh my gosh, look at the Girl Scout, the hobbyist Girl Scout. That's hilarious. I think that's a little bit more than I'd like to pay, although it's still a really good buy. <laughs> Fashionably late. Look at this sign. Oh my gosh, how fun. $18.50. Looks like it's got some age on it, too. That's really quite everything. Speaking of fashionable, look at this crazy coat. Rabbit fur. Wow, that is something else. All right, here we go. One of my favorite little nooks. Looks like they're getting ready for Easter. Zebra planter made in Japan. That's kind of fun. $7. What? We'll take that for $7. What else do they have in here today? This is a cute little daisy box. I believe this is made in England. I've had that one only in green though. I like the orange. And the little fuzzy ceramic chicks. I only need like, ooh, I only need like 40, 50 more cats. Eight bucks, that's not bad. I have a lot like that though in the sale. I'm trying to um, ooh, I'm trying to, uh, branch out a little bit. 22, that's a little bit close. 20% off in this booth. Smiley glass, hobnail, I have a couple of those right now. Somebody's having a hard time in here. Uh, epic chalkware smurf lamp. Probably weighs a lot, though. Look at this Winnie the Pooh teapot. Oh, that's so cool. I almost was hoping it was a Japan one, even though that was that would be too good to be true. This is such a great booth. I uh, see the cat that's still at 20 after the discount. 20 after the discount. Look at the Fenton base. 30. A little close, though. Very good prices for collectors. Look at the Robin Hood guy. Oh my gosh, he's only 12. He's fabulous. And he still squeaks. I, even though he's got some wear, I kind of feel like that's important. Gosh, the music is always so loud at the booths I like. Look at this one, this Lucite Paperweight. That's $8.20, so for um, $6.50, I'll take that. The Flamingo Salt and Pepper Shakers, a Viking Strawberry, very nice. And then this, this booth has major discount happening right now. Hold on. 30% off, unless it has a red dot, then it's 50% off. Let's, uh, got a little lamp in here. Art glass lamp, that's a good one. Look at the squirrel. He would be $7. We'll take a squirrel for $7. Look at this fun little pig lamp. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. It's got a little bit of wear on the shade. But still, there's a lot going on in here, honestly. It's kind of crowded and the music's a little loud, so I'm kind of moving quick. Um, I'll probably end up going to Weaver's after this because it's a little much for me right now. There's a lot of people in here. Uh, here's a stretchy bracelet. That's fun. $3. Uh, kind of needs to be restrung, though. Oh, I'm tempted, but the quality isn't that great. This is a fun necklace. A dollar. Blue plastic swirl necklace. I actually really like that. I'll take that. All right, and in here, I see this Fenton piece. 42. Some jadeite. And then over here, this Tanala bird is kind of fantastic. Let's see. A lot of things that are close. Oh my gosh, look at the brass cricket. How great is he? He's only $8. I 
kind of feel like for $8 and 10% off, we can't leave them there. It's kind of a pain to ship. It would poke through a lot of the packing materials. But still, I think I'm going to go ahead and do that. He's fun. He needs a good home. Well, right before I was about to check out, I checked out these, pun intended. They were in the case up front, $23 for the pair. Blanco mushroom candle holders, very cool. I'm gonna grab those. Well, there was a little too much commotion in there for me. It is Friday afternoon, to be fair. I spent $53, and since that was such a quick trip, I really scored on those Blanco candle holders, by the way. Excuse me, I had to hiccup all the excitement. <laughs> I'm gonna go down the street to Weaver's. I'll see you guys when I get there. All right, hopefully it's a little less uh, chaotic in here. What's this down here? That's kind of pretty. Chip on the ruffle. Oh yeah, I love that color, that style. There's a booth I want to get into, but the vendor's restocking. So I think I'm going to start down here. Oh my gosh, look at this little girl. She's so cute. Ah! Oh my gosh. Dude, what? I'm about to pay every penny for this. I've never even seen that before. That is amazing. A lot of the vintage devil stuff is really hard to come by. And this, I feel like is no exception. This is coming with me. Um, I'm also looking at this. Look at this little, this thing is so great. I usually see it in red. I've never seen it in pink. Flower babies, eight bucks. I'll take that. And what is this fabulous snail? 25, he's pretty great. But I don't think I could get much more out of that after fees. What's this regal fellow? Vintage dogs and wiener dog soap dish, $19. It is Japanese, that's really interesting. Oh, I think it's a little bit much for me for resale. Oh my gosh, look at how fun these are. Kind of wild. Oh, she's great. How much is this? four dollars that's insane i'd be scared to ship that though i wouldn't want to damage her headdress here's a little pink elephant seven bucks that's a good price oh they must have heard i was coming first and foremost the fuzzy ceramic cat as is ten bucks oh uh, it's got some mangled fur but for ten dollars I'll take it. And um, look at the poodle bank. This is fabulous. 17, unfortunately with the crack, I definitely can't justify that. Oh, so much fun. Little cat planter, 17, can't do that either. A lot of good stuff in here today. Well, I grabbed some bangles, but I thought I'd finally um, snag a trip in here. Oh my gosh, look at this pottery horse. This is so great. I love this thing. 10 bucks. I'm looking for a discount sign. It's really fair price. Let me not be cheap like that. Now, yeah, I'm going to take this. This is so good. Okay, so I still didn't get to go all the way through. Look at these guys. Oh my gosh, it's got a little uh, ladybug on its butt. <laughs> That's super cute. Whoa, there's a lot happening in here. Oh, yes. This is the part I've been waiting for. We already know what I'm going for. Butter toasted cashews. I am so ready for this. These are so beautiful. Awesome. Oh my gosh. I just turned the corner to paradise. First and foremost, look at these cat in the tub salt and pepper shakers. $11? What, dude? And 15% off? That's a definite yes. And then look at this little flower baby thingy. What's happening here? It's a planter 18 with 15% off. That's not bad. This looks like an Italian pig. Looks Italian, not to say. Is it Italian? Oof, he's in there. Florence made in Italy. Italy pig. $12, 15% off. I'll take that. 
And then the Pilgrim Glass Deer, the prices here are really great. Is that a deer or a bunny? Rabbit, $14, 15%, that's not bad. Let's see, what else do they have? This is a great booth. Monkey, <laughs> that was just for Dagny. Oh my gosh, look at this doll. This doll is everything. Gosh, it just keeps going. I tell you, these guys have been up in their game over here. Look at this planter. This thing's so cool. 45. Wow, that's really neat looking. And then the orange vase. I feel like we looked at this at the shop along chip, yeah. Well, you know what I'm going for next? Over here. This is gorgeous. 50 bucks. That's really pretty. And then the blue hobnails, 15, is that right? No, 25, excuse me. Clear doesn't do well for me. We've already established that. I love this cat. England, $36. Another weirdo cat. This is kind of nice. Black, 17. Gosh, I think I have a thing for black glass. Cute little piggy bangs. Oh, I feel nuts. This is another danger zone for me. Check out this booth. So good. Uh, this, look, she's got a little cat. Oh my gosh, how cute. Four dollars. That's too adorable. Well, she's got a cat, so she's she's ready for my cat sale. And uh, I love the checkerboard. This is kind of fun. Oh my gosh. It's like a quail made in Japan. What? That's amazing. It would be kind of a nightmare to ship though. Oh, it's so good. And then over here, this is kind of a neat one, even though I just said clear doesn't do well for me. 24, it's really hefty. And then this Blanco up here. Blanco water bottle, 45. Here's a random mushroom. Ceramic hobbyist piece. Look at this. That's fun. Oh my gosh, how cute. Oh, I don't want to get crazy so bad. That's adorable as well. I'm trying to be kind to Piggy. Can't get everything, everything. I really just want to turn my camera off and go to town on these cashews. <laughs> I can't lie. <laughs> but I'm going to finish at least up here look, here's dana's booth she always has such amazing stuff well look at what she has were those here last time i can't remember three for 120 and then she's got all of the mr toodle sets a lot of people see uh precious pooch and thinks it think it's mr toodles but that is in fact the real mr toodles that's really interesting back there check out these giant mushroom salt and pepper shakers these are great 24. Oh, I love this skunk. I feel like I feel like we left this skunk last time. He had something wrong with him, if I remember correctly. Maybe not. He's so cute. Hey, look, Lucite candles. How much are these? $32 sold separately. And uh, that's a nice three-toe vase. I'm not a big blue person, though. Oh my gosh, it's so overwhelming. If I remember correctly, we had some epic finds in this booth as well. Look at this. Pink candle holder, a set of two. Gosh, those are super fragile. I have to. What is this? It's not what I thought it was at all. Wow, I think I needed glasses. That's so funny. I thought it was like one of those weird elf things. All right, so I finally got in this booth I wanted to get into, and the first thing I got were these little tea bag holders. I wanted to get all four, but one had a repair. This one has a little hairline. Oh, but it's so cute. They're $5 each. I think I'm going to do it anyway. Um, and then look at this little flapper girl music box. She's at $11. I'm not going to wind it up because... <laughs> We all know the curse of the music box, but this is perhaps one of the most interesting things I got. This is Townsend glass. It is signed. Um, 
I didn't look too hard online for comps because it's only $13 and I'm just kind of attracted to it. It looked expensive. It was up on the top shelf and the comps are pretty generous. So I think I am going to go ahead and take this as well. Plus it matches my nails. Well, I think I'm going to call it. Uh, I'm enjoying my bag of nuts and I was talking to Nick and then that caught my eye. Look at that giant big light bangle. That's at 35. That is absolutely beautiful. So I'm going to get the key and... Uh, Carry on with my snack time and chat. Everybody follow Weaver's Treasures on whatnot.